Orlando, Florida. Welcome to the final premium live event of the season. Welcome to Clash of Champions Gold Rush. All about all the champions. Should we are defended here tonight? Let's get into it. To start things off. We have our women's tag team championship match. Now this match, whoever wins this match will be the champion for the new season. The champions for the new season. So Candice LeRae and Indy Hartwell have one more shot. This is their last shot at becoming champions before the new season happens. And then we we have the champions, the Iconics. Let's see if they can make it to the new season as champions or not. This is going to be one amazing matchup. The former tag team champions taking on the current ones. Indy Hartwell, Candice LeRae. Both have wanted to become a champions for the Ray. It took a lot of chances, but they finally did it. Tag team champions. But then they failed at evolution when Billy Kay and Peyton Voice took those titles off of them. And here are the champions looking clean as ever. I like the little design, their attire that they have on. Billy Kay, Peyton Royce, already a former women's tag team champions. They just got the titles back. I believe they became champ first became champions at WrestleMania 35. But now they're here. Again as champions. And you know, three out of the four competitors in this match was at Queen of the Ring. Oh yes, we got to talk about Queen of the Ring. And the King of the Ring. So both King and Queen of the Ring will still be the King and Queen up until the next tournament in which they cannot participate in. So Karrion Cross and Bianca Belair, our Raw Women's Champion, will still be our our King our. King of the Ring and Queen of the Ring leading into the new season. But this is for the Women's Tag Team Championships. We will see which one of these women will walk into the new season as champion. Cajun Royce and Candice LeRae will start things off here. Okay, to the gut. Candice LeRae drops with the DDT. Go for an early cover. Super early cover. Off the first move done in the matchup. Candice LeRae wanted to get, become women's tag team champion again. Especially for the new season. So many things that's going to happen in the new season. But Peyton Voice won't allow that to happen for the Ray. Big chops and attack from Candice. And throwing an elbow to the kick from Royce. Big chop. Peyton dropping her. Oh no, this is not good. Ugh. Almost decapitated her head. And here comes Billy. K and Candice DeRay got the hot tag. In comes Hartwell. Now, our Hartwell, the strongest of all four ladies in the matchup. 
She was sacked in the ring. She failed to beat Ronda Rousey. But guess who did beat Ronda Rousey? Women's Tag Team Champion Peyton Royce. So that's a big victory for her. And big clothesline takes her down. Kayla Royce and Billy Kay making frequent tags. Pretty smart. I swear. And out goes Hartwell. And the on the outside, and the referee begins to count. And oh, Billy goes out to meet her. Might have been a bad idea. She gets tossed by Hartwell. And a drop kick to the back of Mindy. And look at this, look at this. Oh, tossing her around the arena. And another toss. Inside the ring they go. Billy, oh, gets kicked in the gut. Our strip sends her to the outside. And now Andy Hartwell making the tag out. Candice LeRae is back in. And here comes Peyton. Arshrif. Oh, sends Billy back out again. This time from Candice. Candice goes to meet each other on the outside here. Kick to the gut. Look at this, look at this. This is not going to be good. Oh, back suplex on the outside. That's definitely going to leave a mark. And now they're back into the ring. They go. Look at this. Oh, trying to go for something. Gets countered by Candice LeRae. And now Candice trying to take control, but gets Irish ripped by K. Oh, elbow to the jaw for Candice. And now LeRae looking for the neck breaker. Hits it. Oh, now they, Andy gets the tag in. Will Pey Billy Kay make the tag? And she does. Payton Royce is back in the matchup. Irish Rip on the apron. Ooh, blocks the punch. Oh, goes over the top rope. We gets caught. Arm wrench. Another arm wrench. Takedown. Hated boy Sean about she was the one to be Ronda Rousey at Green at the ring. Goes for the cover. One, two. Ah, oh, Candice LeRae broke it up. Candice LeRae was in a heated rivalry with the former women's SmackDown Women's Champion Oscar. You know, Asuka lost her title at SummerSlam to Saray. And Saray lost her title to Liv Morgan. And we'll see that rematch tonight. Saray versus Liv Morgan. For the SmackDown Women's Champion in a Tornado DDT. A Satellite DDT, I meant to say. And that breaker. So that will be... One of the matches tonight, Liv Morgan versus Saray, SmackDown Women's Championship. And Candice LeRae up top. Hits us flying moonsault, but no. Billy Kay got the knees up. Big counter there. Kick to the gut. What's this? Brain Buster. Plants her on top of the dome. And y'all go for a big boot. Candice LeRae with a counter. Candice LeRae showing her veteran skills off. And now Candice LeRae goes for the tag out. 
Billy K getting back to her feet, but gets met up by Indy Hartwell trying to go for some kicks. And now Billy Fisherman suplex. And there she goes, tagging out. Peyton Royce is now the legal competitor. Oh, kick to the gut. What's this? Arm trap DDT. And I believe that might be it. One, two. Ah, kick out at two and a half. Candice LeRae gets tagged in. And LeRae looking for something big. Sweeping up the leg. Gargano escaped her husband's finishing submission. And Billy Kay was able to break it up. Oh, but she gets met by Candace, gets tossed to the outside. And oh, a springboard splash to the back of Peyton Royce and into the cover. One, two, the ah, kick out. Peyton Royce getting back into the match. What's this? Final cut. Drops her. Could be it. One, two, no a kick out. And you hear the crowd chanting for these two teams. And oh, a spinning leg kick into the top. Drops the diving knee. And old Candice LeRae fighting back. Got her by the hair. Oh, but Peyton Royce fights out. Oh, trying to go for something gets dodged. Oh, elbow. Try to go for a back suplex. She flips out. Countering, going back and forth. Another arm wrench. And take that. And now Peyton Royce taking control. Big step up kicks. And a big forearm. Not even a forearm. I believe that was just an elbow strike to the jaw. And now Billy K taking control. Candice LeRae back onto the match. Oh, what's this? Roll up, roll up, could do it. One, two, three, no. That was a perfect scenario. Andy Harrow just got taken out. And look at this. Clam slam. Peyton Royce tagged in. And oh, look at this, look at this, look at this. This is definitely gonna hurt. Wicked stepsister. And I believe that's over. Oh, ooh, Billy K broke it up. And doing so, she gets the attention of Candace, but Candace gets caught up. Candace tosses out Billy. And look at this, look at this. Final cut connects in the perfect cover to and the Iconics go into the new season as champions still. Billy K. Payton Voice has absolutely done it. They are still your women's tag team champions. And they will be like that heading into the new season. Let's get to our next match of night, of the night. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, and this match is for the United States Championship. And here we have D 
Damien Priest as he takes on A-Kid, but this match has a special stipulation to it. This match is last man standing. Whoever can keep their opponent down for the 10 counts will be champion. Now, A-Kid was the last time he was in this match. It was at Extreme Rules against MVP. And that was for the rematch since MVP was the champion until 4th of July when A-Kid managed to come out with that battle royale as the champion and then at extreme rules mvp a kid last man standing a kid brought the pain pain and punishment to mvp which allowed a kid to be the last man standing now he's back in the same situation only this time with a different competitor in a different Arena on a different night. We have Damian Priest Now Damian Priest we thought Damian Priest was a good guy And that was until he must have realized that he wanted to be champion more Then have the respect of the crowd So a kid is facing someone a lot more dangerous than MVP in this scenario. And you see the United States Championship graphic right there. Damien Priest, a new look here. All set and a kid, the current champion, last man standing. A proud champion, indeed. Free holds the title up for everyone to see. United States Championship, last man standing, Priest A Kid. And the referee rings the bell. Now, A Kid is a lot smaller than Damien Priest, so Priest has the size advantage, but A Kid has that speed on him. And oh! We will determine which one of these two factors will be the winning factor. Oh, a kid kicked to the back with that counter. Oh, accidentally bumped into him. And now Damian Priest taking control. Try to go for a kick, gets countered. And now a kid hanging him up with the dragon sleeper. Oof. Putting a lot of pressure on the neck area. And a springboard. Oh, a sling blade from A Kid. A Kid using his incredible speed and agility to make sure he can win this matchup. A Kid going for something. Oh, didn't get it off. I think he misconnected, went the wrong area. But no, he's fighting back. A kid in trouble. Ah, just tossed around. And now Damien Priest springboard leg drop. This Damien Priest also has agility as well. Go for a submission, but submissions don't even matter here. I'm pretty sure he just wants to put in punishment and. A kid gets out. 
Oh, a big forearm just yeesh. Smacking him upside the head. And Damien Priest with an elbow drop to the back as AK was trying to get up. And now here comes Damien Priest. Oh my god! Tossing out a kid. That's definitely gonna put some punishment on the back and spine area. We'll try to go for something, but a kid is still fighting here. Flatliner connects. And now a kid goes for something. Oh, gets countered. Suplex. But A Kid, even after everything that's happened, he's still fighting. Oh! And A Kid taking off the tabletop of our announced table. Goes back into the ring, telling Damian Priest to get in. Well, goes for a strike, but Damian Priest attacks first. Wait, Priest. Priest, no, 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 no! Power bomb to the outside. And eesh. And I don't even think AK is getting back up. It's been six. I mean, after already getting tossed out earlier, getting tossed out again. I think he's hurt. New champion. Damian Priest is the new United States champion. Damian Priest is the new United States champion. He started the season as champion. Ends as a champion. Goes into the new season. But I believe A-Kid is injured. He needs help. We had a medical emergency. A kid is being sent to a hospital after what had transpired here tonight. But the show must go on. Now we are here. Final matchup for part one. You Intercontinental Championship. John Cena, the champion, taking on Roderick Strong, the challenger. Strong one of the rematch. The championship rematch. Roderick Strong felt embarrassed by losing to John Cena at SummerSlam. Because Roderick Strong has had a bit of a season this year. First he beat Santos Escobar at Money in the Bank and then at WrestleMania Backlash he lost to the debuting Res Lee and then he won that title back at Extreme Rules and at two out of three false match and then the following SmackDown the rematch was set triple threat between Roderick Strong Res Lee and Santos Escobar and with Jurassic Strong came out still champion and then John Cena challenged him the champion here he comes because he wanted to get every title all day he was missing was the Intercontinental Championship and he won that title at SummerSlam big match up there and now Roderick Strong has the rematch clause. John Cena, Intercontinental Champion. That just sounds weird, but it's true. Intercontinental Champion John Cena. John Cena will, uh, we know John Cena will be here for the new 
season. There's a lot of superstars that probably won't make it to the new season. But let's see if John Cena can go into the new season as champion. And you hear the crowd chanting Cena's name. This match is going to be won for the record. Roderick Strong, the challenger, former champion, two time intercontinental champion, taking on the champion. John Cena. Cena looking for a big title defense here, heading into the new season. Roger Stahl looking at the one thing he wants the most. Strong Cena. We'll see who gets to be champion for the new season. Referee rings the bell. Irish rip it to the corner. And Roderick Strong going out early offense. Multiple stomps into the corner. Roderick Strong. Oh, Cena with the roll through. Cena. Oh, wait, what's Cena going for? A figure four. Figure four, the man, going for the submission of the man who's tied up in world championships with Stomp gets dodged under. Watch of Strong takes him back into the corner. Strong, oh, a big punch. Watch it, Strong is feeling it. You got to take any offense you can get against Cena. Follow a slam connects. And now he goes for another a ground and pound attack. Uh oh, look at this, look at this. Ripcord knee strike. And now Roderick Strong climbing to the top rope. Drops the elbow, but no Cena rolls out the way. Big punch from Cena. And Cena drops the elbow. John Cena back to taking control. Big punch to the side. Now he's got him up, but Strong rolls out the back. Got him up, backbreaker. And the Messiah, the backbreaker, showing who he really, how, where he got that name from. But Cena is back into the thick of things. Dropped the elbow, no. Roderick Strong moved out the way that time. Another kick to the gut, but gets caught. But Cena gets turned around. And now Roderick Strong using that amateur wrestling maneuver to squeeze the life out of Cena. And Roderick Strong, big headbutt. Strong could be champion. Oh, good check. All it takes is one big move from Vodrick. And a heartache. Could be it. One, two, three. No, we almost had a new champion. Vodrick Strong almost became a three time intercontinental champion. But Cena feeling it here. You can't see me. Hits it. Five knuckle snuffle, but no. Roderick Stone moves out the way at the last second. But Cena back on the offense inverted suplex. And now Cena doing something we barely see him do. Climbing to the top rope. Oh, the diving famouser. John Cena risking it all to be champion still. 
But Roderick Strong gets caught up. Big power bomb. And Cena drops the elbow. John Cena looking incredibly strong here. And the attitude adjustment hits. The AA could be the end. And it is. John Cena is still your intercontinental champion for the new season. John Cena is here. He won that title at SummerSlam, making that dream come true of being Intercontinental Champion. And he ends this season as champion. That's the end of part one. We'll see you again for part two.